North Dakota winters, to put it kindly, tend to overstay their welcome, which can create issues for spring sports. Michael Anthony tells us how Williston State College is looking to address the issue. Not every day can be as great as this one. In fact, this past winter has kept Williston State's baseball team away from home for most of the season. What, our first 32 games this year were on the road and it's not like we're right down the street, you know, in Watford City or something like that. I mean, we're all over the place. It's another challenge them and many teams around North Dakota have to deal with. You got starters and stuff that are uh, scheduled to play a game, and when that gets switched up, you know, it throws the mojo off on the whole team. A potential fix comes in the form of a turf field, which the Williston State College Foundation is looking to fundraise for both its baseball and softball fields. Turf makes snow removal more easier compared to grass fields, which would allow local teams more opportunities to practice outside and play more home games. This is a major upgrade for our community and especially for our campus and one that we think will go very, very smoothly. The foundation is also planning to expand both facilities by adding secure fencing, new grandstands, restrooms, and concessions. I feel like they'll like it over this field. That's It'll good. be easier to maintain, like get the snow off of it and everything. Williston is one of only two Class A cities without a turf field, making this project long overdue. It's a huge leg up from a recruiting aspect. I think it is really going to put things over the top, and you know we couldn't be more excited. The new fields would also be used by Williston High School's baseball and softball teams, giving them an early advantage in the season. In Williston, I'm Michael Anthony, reporting for your news leader.